The Destruction of Sennacherib. A poem by Lord Byron. The Destruction of Sennacherib is a poem by Lord Byron, first published in 1815 in his Hebrew Melodies, in which it was titled The Destruction of Sennacherib. The poem is based on the biblical account of the historical Assyrian siege of Jerusalem in 701 BC by Assyrian king Sennacherib, as described in the Bible. 2 Kings 18. 19, Isaiah 36. 37. The rhythm of the poem has a feel of the beat of a galloping horse's hooves. An anapestic tetrameter. As the Assyrian rides into battle, historical, Sennacherib was king of Assyria. His army invaded Judea. And besieged Jerusalem but was overthrown. 185,000 of his men. Were destroyed in a single night. Sennacherib returned in haste with the remnant to his own country. Let's look at the poem. The Destruction of Sennacherib. By. Lord Byron. Stanza 1. The Assyrian came down like the wolf on the fold. And his cohorts were gleaming in purple and gold. And the sheen of their spears was like stars on the sea. When the blue wave rolls nightly on deep Galilee. To repeat. The Assyrian came down like the wolf on the fold. And his cohorts were gleaming in purple and gold. And the sheen of their spears was like stars on the sea. When the blue wave rolls nightly on deep Galilee. Stanza 2. Like the leaves of the forest when summer is green. That host with their banners at sunset were seen. Like the leaves of the forest when autumn hath flown. That host on the morrow lay with a dense drown. Stanza 2. Like the leaves of the forest when summer is green. That host with their banners at sunset were seen. Like the leaves of the forest when autumn hath flown. That host on the morrow lay with a dense drown. Stanza 3. For the angel of death spread his wings on the blast. And breathed in the face of the furs he passed. And the eyes of the sleepers waxed deadly and chill. And their hearts but once heaved, and forever grew still. Stanza 3. For the angel of death spread his wings on the blast. And breathed in the face of the furs he passed. And the eyes of the sleepers waxed deadly and chill. And their hearts but once heaved, and forever grew still. Stanza 4. And there lay the steed with his nostril all wide. But through it there rolled not the breath of his pride. And the foam of his gasping lay white on the turf. And cold as the spray of the rock beating surf. And there lay the rider distorted and pale. With the dew on his brow and the rust on his mail. And the tents were all silent, the banners alone. The lances unlifted, the trumpet unblown. Stanza 4. And there lay the steed with his nostril all wide. But through it there rolled not the breath of his pride. And the foam of his gasping lay white on the turf. And cold as the spray of the rock beating surf. And there lay the rider distorted and pale. With the dew on his brow and the rust on his mail. And the tents were all silent, the banners alone. The lances unlifted, the trumpet unblown. Stanza 5. And the widows of Asher are loud in their wail. And their idols are broke in the temple of Baal. And the might of the Gentile, unsmote by the sword. Hath melted like snow in the glance of the Lord. Stanza 5. And the widows of Asher are loud in their wail. And their idols are broke in the temple of Baal. And the might of the Gentile, unsmote by the sword. Hath melted like snow in the glance of the Lord. End of the poem. Key pointers. Note the development. 1. Brilliant outset of the Assyrian cavalry. 2. Their summer changes to winter. 3. The angel turns their sleep into death. 4. The steed and the rider. 5. The morning. 6. Their idols powerless to help them. 7. Their religion broken down. 8. Their power melted like snow. End of the poem and the topic. Thank you. Subscribe to the channel. And stay updated.